What's up everyone? Tinga230 here. Hope you guys are having a great day. So welcome to Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen on the PC. I originally played this on the console, on the PS3 specifically, and I had a blast playing it for the 20 to 30 hours that I did, but I never got the chance to beat it. So I'm glad it's out on the PC right now so I can start fresh, start from the beginning, and learn the ins and outs, all the systems and everything once again. So I also want to let you guys know I'll be gone for the next two to three days and I want, just want to do this quick video of the prologue for Dragon's Dogma and continue on with it once I get back. So, let's play. I'm so excited. In another place, in another life, another child of man blazes your path. Oh man, it looks so good. It looks so good on the PC. Like the frame rate is... I do have a light source. Here is my light source. It's it's over here. Now I, I get to use it and, and click. And there it is. There's my light source. The end of the beginning. Quest log updated. I guess I'll follow Saldi or whatever his name is. The Got a lot of... Roost is just beyond. We should hurry. Holy shit, I can tell. There's a lot of dead guys here. Wow, that guy's dead too. There's a lot of things that I like didn't really get to notice. I didn't know there were like so many dead guys when I was playing on, on the consoles before. Okay. And there's a dragon. Okay. It's telling me left alt is to block. He's talking to me. Alright, let's take out these goblins. And so he's gone. Let's jump down here. Invoking the stone can gain you new allies known as pawns, whose loyalty in battle will never falter. So essentially these pawns, at least these two are just NPCs for now. But the pawns you actually get after you create your character are other people's pawns. And, and pawns are cool because they learn when they're like with other people who are playing. So like for instance, I remember that one of my pawns got sent off to... To another dude, like who's who's playing, and he did a quest that I didn't do yet, and and my pawn came back, and she learned that quest that I was about to do that I never did before, and it was awesome. So it's just a lot of stuff like that, which is like really cool. Wow, somebody really hurled an arrow there. So one of the coolest aspects of this whoa shit of this game is the combat, and I am looking forward. To playing this again because it's is he holding it wow he's holding that little dude <laughs> good job Saldi okay Morgana so we're definitely gonna fight that thing <laughs> it's a goblin all right let's head inside and holding room let's take this guy out and What's up, dude? So, we helped you out. I noticed that the lighting was like, at least the shadow quality was a lot better. So it was like a greater effect. That's a harpy. As you can tell, it's cackling at me. It's a snow harpy. Are we in the snow? I don't know. What are you gonna do? Please draw its attention. What the? Good God, we're... Where the hell? Did, okay. Oh, nice. Good job, Morgana. Okay, should be dead now. Thanks, Quince. Quince. I definitely needed your arrows for that. Pay heed to the world around you. Some ledges may be scaled, but a long fall will end in injury or death. I don't want that to happen. I'm gonna take these guys out. Oh, sorry. Okay, I'll I'll do it. Oh man. I just cut its belly. It's it's so cool. I blocked, but it was the wrong way. That guy looks really pissed. Oh, shield bash. Oh, nice. You pierced him after I shield bashed. No, Morgana. What the hell? What is wrong with you, you harpy? It's because she's tiny. She she's e she's like easily picked up.
Thanks, guy. Hey. You're the one we saved. Is it dead? Yeah, it's pumped full of arrows. Ooh, let's open that. You opened it for me. That's thank you. Yeah, pawns are just like they're they're so active when you're Our army is They're just really active. They like pick shit up for you too. It's awesome. Like if I remember right, like if you pick something up that you always pick up, like your pawns will uh pick up anything. It's just like learning from how you play. No, Sir Pilati. That sucks. Look at that, dude. Look how big giant its face is. Okay, the chimera. I, I need to chop off its tail. Oh my god. I forgot. I remember, like, getting hit so much when I was playing this. And there was, like, no dodge or anything that I remember. Oh. Yeah, climb on its tail. I don't remember how to climb on things. Okay. Okay, we're good. Okay, gotta defeat the goat's head. I'm trying to get the... Oh, I'm trying to get the snake. The snake tail. And there's the snake tail. Get it? Get it? Get it? Okay, guys, good job. Oh, you're after me. You're after me. You're not coming after me. I, f I don't know how to grab. I forgot how to grab. Is it F? Oh, shit, it's F. It is F. Kill the goat. I think... Oh, I think the goat's dying, but then... The, the, the chimera in general is just really pissed. Oh god, let's get it. Ugh. Grab on! Aim for the- aim- Get that goat! Get that- kill that goat! Is the snake dead yet? Oh fuck. Yes! Nice! We killed the snake! I kept- I kept chopping its booty. Oh hell yeah! We are- Getting the upper advantage. Look at this thing. Look at this. Look at this. So awesome. Take it out. It's almost dead. Woohoo! How, how much health do you have? You have a ton of health. Oh, there's three bars. Once for each of the, uh... Each of its parts. Its tail, the goat head, and then pretty much the lion. Come on. You don't have a back kick, do you? Morgana. Holy shit. Oh, yes. Knock down. Shield bash! Yes! It's it's battles like this in Dragon's Zogma that is so awesome. Like, I still remember fighting the Griffin. And that was so dope. Where, where am I? Now choose. Flee or step forward. Take hold of what lies beyond. Claim master. Le Placier, uh, okay, the delightful and ever novel pleasure of a useless occupation. Henri de something. Alright, so this is the character creator for Dragon's Dogma. Obviously, I'm going to choose a female. And there's like a lot of detail you can do in terms of character customization. Um, once you're done with this, which is your like your main character, you also have to do the same thing for your pawn. 
So it's really detailed, like, in that sense, because you're really, like, crafting your pawn as well. So I'm actually going to end the episode of Dragon's Dogma right here, since I said I was going to make the episode really quick, because I have to go. But let me know if you guys liked the video, and if you guys made it this far, thanks for watching. And as always, take care, and Tinga230 out. Alright guys, I'll see you in a couple of days. Game on, everybody.